Hello, Wisdom Family. God bless you. Fountain Hendricks here. I want to discuss with you a brief topic about age. Age is nothing but a number. Now, I know you have heard this saying before, but I want to enlighten you to a different perspective. Now, age has the power to discourage you or encourage you. If you're young, age discourages you because people will count you out. They will overlook you. They will assume you don't know anything. They will believe that you're immature and etc. If you're older, age can discourage you in believing that you don't have any more time available for you or you've missed the boat or you've missed the mark or basically uh, you don't have any more room to do anything else and basically your day of death is coming sooner than what you think or life is over as you speak and you know all these other entities may come in factor of that you may not have anything else to give or nothing more to give. All of that is baloney. All of that is nonsense. Now yes, age can discourage you However, it should not discourage you. Here's why. God does not promote, he does not exalt, and he does not excel people based on their age. God blesses people, God promotes people, he exalts people based on their stage, not their age. When Moses, no, not Moses, when Abraham was called by God to separate from his family, to leave his country and to fulfill the will of God upon his life so that he may have many descendants and become the father of faith. Abraham was close to 80 years old. When David was called to be the king of Israel, he was not experienced. He was not seasoned. He was 16. When Jeremiah was called to be a prophet to the nations, he was not experienced. He was not old. He was not mature. He didn't have all this life experience underneath his belt. He was a boy. God blesses people, exalts people based on their stage and their condition, their mental condition, their physical health, their spirit, their mind, their gifts, their talents, their abilities. It has nothing to do with age. Whether you're 61 or whether you're 16, that does not determine how God will bless you. Whether you're 31 or whether you're 13, it does not determine how God will exalt you. Whether you're 81 or you're 18, it does not determine how God will promote you. God does not bless you based on your age. He blesses you based on your stage. Let me give you an example. If an 18-year-old studies the kingdom laws, studies the word of God, worships daily, Follows the instructions of the Holy Spirit compared to a person who's 51 years old and is disobedient. They do not study the word of God. They disregard everything the Holy Spirit says. They're on their own accord, operating on their own agenda. God will promote and exalt the 18 year old who is dedicated to his will instead of the person who's 51 and walks away from his will. Why? Because it's about the stage, the mentality, and the condition of the person rather than the age. Age does not produce blessings. Age does not produce exaltation. Age does not produce promotion. Stage does. The condition, the mentality, the mindset. So whether you're 80 or you're 8 years old, it doesn't matter where you are in life. My question, you, my question to you is this. Where are you in God? Where are you in God? If you are in a great place with God, the blessings of heaven will rain upon you. But if you're nowhere with God, God will not promote you, will not bless you, will not increase you, will not exalt you. Age is nothing but a number. It is symbolic of your years on the earth, but it has no reference or no relevance to how God will bless you. So if you want to see the fullness of God, make sure you stay close to his will. You study his word. You dedicate yourself to his ways. And I promise you, you will see new doors open. You will see greater opportunity flourish and you will see your life rise to a new level that you have never seen before. God bless you. I love you. Take care. Thank <laughs> you.